Hello everyone. Recently, CBSE has changed the question paper pattern for the board exam 2021. So they have introduced a new question paper pattern called as case study based question. In today's video, I will be discussing a case study based question from the chapter lines and angles. Once, four students from class 9 were selected for plantation of flower plants in the school garden. The selected students were Pangas, Raju, Deepak and Rin. As shown, PQ and MN are parallel lines of the plants. Pangaj planted a sunflower plant at P, Raju planted another sunflower plant at Q, further Deepak was asked to plant any flowering plant at the point M, he planted a mini gold there. Now it was the turn of Renu, she was told to plant a flowering plant different from these three planted one, so she planted a rose plant at N. So there was a water pipeline XY which intersect PQ and MN at A and B. Angle XBN given that it is 60 degree, so this is the given data. So Pangaj planted a flowering plant at the point P and Raju planted another flowering, uh, another sunflower plant at the point Q. Then uh, Deepak was asked to plant some other flowering plant. So he planted a marigold at the point M and Renu planted a flowering plant at the point N. So these are two parallel lines. They have given the length also 5 meter and 4 meter. Also, XY is the water pipe they told. Actually, it is the transversal. We know if a line cuts to a parallel line, it will be the transversal. So, XY is the transversal. So, now let's see the what are the questions they have asked. So, first question is, what is the value of angle set? So, whenever two lines are cut by a transversal, we have corresponding angles the angles formed are corresponding angles then we have alternate interior angles also we have one more pair of angle which is called as co-interior angles on the same side of the transversal so now corresponding angles we can see here pq and mn are two parallel line xy is the transversal so corresponding angles are angle 2 and angle 5 their measurement will be equal angle 3 and angle 7 their pair of corresponding angles angle 1 and angle 6 that is another pair of corresponding angles again 4 and angle 8 is another pair of corresponding angles now alternate interior angles means the corners of the set if we draw like this the corners of the set will form the alternate integer angles so angle 4 is equal to angle 5 and angle 3 equal to angle 6 Next is co-interior angle on the same side of the transversal that is angle 4 plus angle 6 they are co-interior angle these two are co-interior angle they will form supplementary they, uh, the sum of those two angles will be 180 degree so angle 3 plus angle 5 equal to 180 degree so these are the different pairs of angles that form when you when two parallel lines are cut by a transversal now let's see the figure and find out the answer what is the value of angle set so angle set equal to you can see here this is 60 degree angle is set and this angle will form linear pair axiom so 180 minus 60 which is equal to 120 degree angle set equal to 120 degree and the next question is what is the value of angle x so angle x and this angle will form the corresponding pairs of angles so value of angle x is 60 degree So value of Z is 120 degree and this one is 60 degree. Next question, what is the value of angle P plus Q? So let's see what is P plus Q. We know that these two angles will form vertically opposite angles. So this is 60 again by linear pair axiom. P plus Q will be 180 degree. Linear pair axiom means if a ray stands on a straight line, some of the adjacent angle formed will be 180 degree. Next question, which angle is the corresponding angle to angle A? So angle corresponding to angle A, this is the A, angle corresponding to angle A is angle Q. So it is angle Q. Again, what is the value of P plus Q plus A plus Z divided by 6? So we have here P plus Q does 180 degree, A plus Z that is also 180 degree, 180 plus 180 divide by 6 they told 360 divide by 60 is 60 degree so in today's video we have seen a case study based question from the chapter lines and angles thank you for watching my video